Welcome back guys, this is your guy from Granville Tech. Today, I want to discuss with you how relevant the MacBook Pro from the year 2012 is in the year 2021. First, I want to start off with the ports and connectivity. Starting on the left side at the back is the MagSafe charging port. MagSafe is a system that connects the computer to the charging cable using magnets rather than a solid plug-in connection. This port has the main function of charging the device with the secondary but very important feature of disconnecting in case of an accidental force. For example, if someone tripped or if someone tried to move the device while forgetting to unplug it, this feature would take over. Continuing with the port, we have next the Ethernet port. This port is a port that allows you to connect your device to other network capable devices. Followed closely by the FireWire port. This is a special port that is used to transfer files between devices such as your computer uh, to a 3.5 inch hard disk drive and this goes up to 800 megabits of speed for this particular device. To be honest, I'm not familiar with this port and regardless its benefits, I don't want to spend on it at this point. The reason for this is that I do plan to upgrade possibly later on this year and that would make a firmware device practically unnecessary. Next up we have the Thunderbolt port. Thunderbolt allows you to connect your computer to external devices such as external hard drives enjoying speeds of up to 10 gigabytes per second. It also doubles as a mini display port, allowing you to connect external monitors. Next, we have two Type A USB 3 ports. These give you the ability to connect most of your devices that comes with this USB Type port, and the speed goes all the way up to 5 gigabytes per second. So, if you have your phone and you want to transfer files between your phone and your computer, you can do so at quite decent speeds. And this includes, of course, as said before, external drives and cameras, etc. The other slot we have is the SD card slot. Everybody enjoys having an SD card slot on, on their computer. This allows you to plug your SD card in your computer and transfer files from your camera, for example, quickly on the fly. Now practically all these ports I am mentioning have been removed from Apple laptops and have been replaced with USB-C ports requiring a dongle for anything that is not a USB-C peripheral. I have been hearing though that Apple is bringing back a couple ports on their laptops and the SD card slot seems to be one of them. Anyway, back to our discussion. The next slot that comes up in line is the audio line input port followed by the audio line output port. Now, because this is a pro device, it comes with two separate audio ins and out ports. As a musician, this is excellent for me, as I can connect my computer direct to the mixer system without needing extra dongles and making extra connections. This is one less thing I have to worry about that I could forget or that could go faulty and not work. When it comes to hardware, this MacBook 2012 is very equipped. It came with a NVIDIA GeForce GT650M graphics card with 512 megabytes of memory. They also come with their choice of i7 processors from 2.3 gigahertz up to 2.7 gigahertz. And this is the base clock speed. The processors are capable of speeding up, depending on the unit, all the way to 3.7 gigahertz. They come with upgradable memory, four gigabytes to start with. The unit also has a backlit keyboard with adjustable brightness, control, and excellent key travel and feel. It has a front-facing camera and comes equipped with a multi-touch trackpad that has swiping capabilities and much more. These devices are well equipped. They are well decked out with ports 
and with ins and outs you cannot go wrong having a device with such connectivity this concludes what i would like to share with you in relation to the macbook pro 2012 being used in 2021 this will be the first part of a series of videos so join me next time where i discuss with you how i upgraded mine some of the internals and what i plan to do for the future do subscribe and take care until we meet again